This farm in the countryside of the state of Rio de Janeiro is home to a group of animals helping to develop a treatment against COVID-19. These horses have been inoculated with the human coronavirus. The antibodies they produce, in theory, could save lives when injected into humans. Similar research with horse plasma has been conducted in China. In Brazil, work with equine antibodies is underway at Rio's state-owned Vital Brasil Institute. So far, the results in China and Brazil have been promising. Surprisingly, these animals produce an enormous amount of antibodies and a very high antibody concentration. And not only that, in a second step, we saw that these antibodies also had a very substantial capacity to neutralize the virus. In mid-October, we are already starting the clinical test together with a group of 40 patients in hospital networks in the state of Rio de Janeiro. Doing the clinical test in phase 2, we go to phase 3, and we believe that in about four months, we already have a product approved by Anvisa, which is the regulatory body of the Brazilian government. In São Paulo, researchers at the state's Butantan Institute are also working with horse plasma. The Butantan is a state pharmaceutical laboratory best known in the country for its production of vaccines and anti-venom serums, in which horses are injected with venom extracted from poisonous animals. And earlier this year, Butantan signed a deal with Chinese pharmaceutical company Sinovac Life Sciences to test and hopefully produce and distribute a vaccine against the novel coronavirus. The state of Sao Paulo could begin vaccinations as early as December. The world is counting on the development of a viable vaccine to fight COVID-19, but to contain the disease, other treatments like antiviral drugs may be necessary. Scientists are working with the horse plasma to create a type of immunotherapy called passive immunization. Antibodies produced in equine serum could complement the vaccination effort. Researchers call vaccines active immunity because they activate the patient's immune system to produce antibodies. In the passive immunization process, antibodies are produced by a different animal and injected into patients to provide immediate protection. Doctors are already using a similar treatment using human plasma donated by patients recovered from COVID-19. The principle is the same. The difference is the horses can produce much more antibodies than uh, a, a person that acquired uh, the, the infection. We hope, we hope this product can treat patients, neutralizing the virus. This patient will not evolve to complications such as pneumonias. Human trials are yet to begin and there is a risk of side effects connected to equine byproducts that need to be carefully weighted. If proven safe, producing syrup from horses' plasma is a well-established and relatively simple technology that could be an essential treatment against COVID-19. Paulo Cabral, CGTN, São Paulo.